hey guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm going to be talking all about my real hair yes i am a lot of people always ask me about it um on several different platforms and i'm going to try to start making more videos about my real hair but you guys know that i really do not do a lot when it comes to my hair i am still the same old broken record in fact i will list some um some of my hair videos my real hair videos in the description box of this video and also in some of the cards up above so make sure you look out for those and also at the end of the video there will be links so that you can just click straight onto some of those videos okay so I want to get straight into this video this is going to be a little bit differently I don't think I've ever done one like this before but I'm going to be showing you guys five products that I have been absolutely loving lately for my Tex Lax hair okay absolutely love it and if you have not noticed this is my hair out this is all of my hair I don't have any type of extensions no clippings no nothing this is all me child I did do a text lax recently and I decided to do like a little silk press um unfortunately I did not get that on camera I didn't think you guys wanted to see me actually like doing the silk press on my hair but if you would like to see something like that just leave it down below and I will be sure to make a video like that so let's get right into these five products that I have been loving for my Tex Lex hair lately. All right, y'all. So let's get started on the first product. Okay. So the first product is going to be this, uh, the main choice. I don't know what this is. Conditioner. It's um, some revitalize and refresh conditioner. So this is what it looks like. I don't know if this is going to focus. Let's see. So this is what it looks like. I will leave it linked down below if you guys want to go and check it out. So you, you know that I'm more so like a simple girl. I use simple, all natural products. But what I have been doing lately, I've been going to the stores and I've been trying out several things. Because if I'm going to be a hair guru, so to say, I need to try some different things. I normally don't like to try them on my real hair. I like to try stuff on wigs because my hair does just does not like new things. My hair likes basic, fresh, and just simple, basically, okay? And I think everyone, everyone here does as well, but I just know mine a little bit better because I have treated my hair and I've just been working on my hair for so many years, okay? But this particular product, I really, really like. No, this is not sponsored or anything like that. I've just been trying a lot of stuff and this is something that has made the cut recently. So what it is, it is a conditioner, co-wash a leave-in and a detangler so it's all in one guys so if your hair is like gets really matted or really tangly and this isn't just for ticks like hair this could be for natural hair all hair types as a matter of fact so i know that sometimes when i do my stretches for six to eight months or sometimes eight to twelve months my hair can get kind of tangled up, like tangly or unmanageable, so to say, okay? Very, very thick. Sometimes I can barely get through it. So while I'm stretching it, I use this. If I do need to do like a co-wash or something like that, because you guys know I don't use a lot of shampoo. I don't really like the idea of shampoo a whole lot. You guys know my spill on that if you've been following me for a long time. But this right here goes so good as like a co-wash. And it does say it on here, like I said, co-wash, leave-in, and detangler. It goes good whenever... I'm I'm on those days where I just need to get a wash in or my hair is just visibly filthy or I just feel like I just need to pick me up on my hair this does so well and as far as detangling it detangles my hair so so nicely y'all like I don't like to use the blow dryer as much whenever my hair is wet because I don't like the excessive heat um so I do like to let it air dry so to say so whenever I get done doing my little co-wash or whatnot I will like brush it back put it into like a little braid or a little twist and I'll put I'll make I'll uh, coming out with this because you want Wanna, you don't always want to comb your hair out while it's wet but especially being text lax but um but this really does help it makes my hair so silky so smooth so soft super 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 soft it has a really nice smell to it as well there is another bottle of this but i think it's like red and orange or so but i do like this one i like this darker purple one this works for me i haven't tried the other one yet but this stuff is great and it leaves my hair with a nice moisture and sheen my hair feels just so nice and healthy i can't say i've noticed a difference since actually using this product like i said i'm not sponsored but i would say give them a try i'm looking into trying some of their other uh, the other things in the line as well um they're kind of on the pricier side but i would say that it's definitely worth it all right 
I'm going to move to some shampoo and some conditioner. These probably look all icky because I just got them out the shower. Now, I used to use my Dollar Tree shampoo and conditioner. Y'all know I would just live by that. It doesn't really matter. Um, now, I kind of stepped it up a bit, okay? I started using Aussie. I've, I've heard of it before, but, you know, I was always into the, I think it was like Pantene and um i was just like you know let me try something different so i picked these up and i got the kind let's see avocado with avocado australian jojoba oil so this is what they are looking like and they're pretty much empty i just squeezed the heck out of these and i love them like i really do these leave my hair feeling so soft and bouncy and airy and just i don't know if it, it it leaves me feeling like a new woman okay again not sponsored but i absolutely love these and i've had them in a couple of different scents and i love that it makes my hair smell so fresh and so nice and it's just nice in the conditioner it makes my hair super super soft all right so i would definitely say i do love these aussie products i have been trying some other things in their line i'm not liking some of the other things so much but if you would like a video on that please leave a comment like down below on some products that i actually do not like for my hair but as far as these they're are, they are a go for real so all right so moving right along i have just picked up this product right here so what this is is the herbal essence and this is made with argon oil and i absolutely love argon oil okay i love it by itself um after i get done doing any kind of styling or washing or conditioning i always use argon oil so i picked these up and I've been using these for a couple of weeks now and I absolutely love them uh, so far. Now, as far as this smell, this is not the best smell. I don't really, I don't really like it, child, but I got it and uh, it is what it is. All right. But, um, but yeah, I use these. I, I don't have to use, you don't have to use a whole lot. And the same thing with the Aussie products, a little bit goes a super long way. Um, my hair used to just drink up and just eat up product. But I found that once I start switching my products up, things begin to be differently like my hair started to kind of take to them differently and i didn't find myself using as much product i don't know maybe it's kind of weird maybe it's just me but um but yeah i'm really really loving these like i said i've been using these for a couple of weeks now but i've been using the aussie for about six months and I'm telling you, love it. And I wouldn't have switched from them, but like I said, I've been trying to kind of branch out and use some other things, okay? So let me know if you guys have tried the Aussie or the Herbal Essence and tell me about y'all's experience and kind of like how y'all like them or if you don't like them, feel me in, girl. Let me know. All right, so moving right along, guys, I am getting into one of my favorite products, okay? So this is the Iso Plus Gel. I wish I, oh, I have another one or whatever. I also have this one it looks all icky and it's almost gone this I really kind of put this this gel on the map in my wet look video because I use this on my curly hair but I absolutely love this gel all right I love it love it love it love it love it is very very slept on I would say in recent times it has went up just a little bit but it's, it's not too expensive I think this is like under five bucks maybe but anyways, it used to be a really, really slept on brand and you used to only find it at certain beauty supply sh shops. Like I used to have to go to like the hood, hood child and I used to have to get this product, okay? But now it's easier to find. It's just about everywhere. And I'm gonna tell you what I really, really, really love about this particular gel. I love it because it says extra conditioning and that's exactly what it is. I'm gonna come up close so you guys can see, yeah. So they have a couple of different kinds, but I like this kind. I also like the orangey yellowy kind. So it says extra conditioning. So it is extra conditioning. It does not cause any flaking. It does not dry my hair out. You can wear this every single day. It will leave your hair like moisturized. It, it's kind of like you're putting a very light foam on your hair or something, but it's it definitely is gel. It has a light hold, but even though it's light, it's powerful because it does hold your hair down. It holds your edges down. It doesn't leave them crunchy. It gives you that nice, natural look i'm telling y'all this company ain't never paid me okay all right even when this crap went viral they never paid me but i still stand behind their product behind their products and i still love their products this is something that i love i do not use any type of gel i don't prefer eco gel sometimes i use it like on my wigs but it's just it, it be doing too much for me child but this right here is something that i just always go back to and it's my absolute favorite i got it on my edges today and it just looks soft it just looks soft it looks natural and 
it's not doing a whole lot it's not a super slick look it's not giving me that um the edge control look it's not giving me that it's just giving me nice natural and flowing my hair can still move and it still looks put together okay so moving right along child we're gonna get into i think we on number five number six i don't know i wasn't counting <laughs> but moving right along i'm gonna get into two products i'm gonna actually put them together and it's gonna be these child okay so these right here and this might not be the cleanest i'm sorry but these two are great 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 when it comes to aid in hair growth and also just it's just good good for your hair all right everyone should have this a part of their collection um this would be i'm guessing like a dimming brush okay so i got this brush from walmart and it's by the brand evolve absolutely love this brush love it so much and i also got this comb just from my local dollar tree and it was just a dollar and i always i have multiple combs like this i like to keep one in the shower whenever i'm doing my conditioner or my washes or whatnot because I like to really get in there and get through my scalp and make sure I got everything out. And I also, I have a few of these as well. Because for some reason, Curtis thinks we growing legs and walking off okay but um but anyways i absolutely love this brush it's amazing it's not too harsh or not too hard on my head and it really gets in there when it comes to detangling so i would say that if you have not added added these two to your collection i would definitely go add them okay so i think that's pretty much it guys i really didn't want to ramble through this video too much i really wanted to just bring you guys uh some products that i have been using and that i have been loving lately i wanted to let you guys know that i am trying a lot of products so that I can bring y'all some new fresh content and it's just not always the same stuff there's new products coming out all the time and people are always on the hunt for hair products and what's new what can grow your hair what's the best you know what I'm saying and I'm here to tell you some stuff just just ain't good okay it's just not <laughs> And a lot of stuff I try behind the scenes, but I never bring it on here. So why not bring it on here and incorporate it with you guys, my friends, okay? <laughs> so I just wanted to show you guys what my hair was looking like. It is doing its thing. It's doing what it normally does. It definitely is understanding the assignment today. It's flourishing. You know, it's just taking in some fresh air and it's just doing its thing. Dang, all right so let me know how you guys felt about this video also let me know what you guys want to see also if there's some products that you may want me to try you have questions about some products please leave them down below and i will come back to you guys with a video because most likely i've probably already used them <laughs> i'll probably already use them and uh yeah i think that's pretty much it guys i'll see you